take a step into New Zealand's finest automotive engineering and ingenuity. The need for a new racing class and the initiative of two brave brothers with a dream in mind. To build a mid-engine race car that would shatter records and make everyone gossiping about it. That's how the Algi Alfetta was born, to defy physics and to bring a real wind of change in the competitive New Zealand racing world. It all started back in 1978 when Ian and Barry Algi purchased a brand new Alfa Romeo Alfetta GTV in Italy to turn into one of a kind mid engine race car concept. They actually had to mold and cast their own wheel flares, purchasing magnesium mini light wheels and brake components from England and turning their attention from a turbocharged Porsche engine to a more favorable and durable fuel-injected 5-liter Chevy V8 302 with Lucas injection, Brodix 23 degree heads and a standard Z28 steel crank and turned up to scream at 8500 RPM. The Alfetta's most prominent feature is the location of its engine, behind the firewall and right inside the cabin, forcing the driving position to be moved to the back seats. This is what sparked the debate among general public and racing officials causing much controversy and ultimately boosting the overall popularity of the sports then racing division while bringing substantial rule changes to it too. Ian also retained the factory Alfetta transaxle transmission which incorporated gearbox with dog gear set, clutch, differential and inboard rear brakes although with some major modifications done by adding an active oil lubrication and cooling system throughout. As for the handling of the vehicle, a massive rear spoiler was installed to increase stability while cornering at high speeds. With its almost perfect weight distribution and new center of gravity move towards the rear, the LG brothers indeed succeeded in creating a sedan version of a mid-engine race car. We are here at Hampton Downs today with Angus Fogg at the wheel for a brief track session. Let's hear this Alfetta absolutely rip on track, it's what we all been waiting for.